Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you can install a QR code action and you can create any QR code anywhere in your Flow Builder. So first of all you go to the App Store and select the QR code anywhere action or app and you click the installation link which will take you to a page like this. Then you click install at the bottom of your screen which will take you to the page get this image out of the way here you have all your pages and you will just select the page on which you are going to install it click install then you have this little screen right here and you click go to app settings the screen will load take a second or two and there you have it this is the setting screen you can just copy this code right here or if you want to use it more than 50 times a month you just get yourself a license key at chattemplates.com from there on as you can see the app is now installed so after that you will go to the flow section if you have installed the sample template, you have this uh, flow already present, but I will show you how to do it from scratch. So here is not a lot yet, as you can see, just something I created on the fly really quick. Just a message, create a QR code. Let's do it. And then you go to this action menu click on action scroll all the way to the bottom and there you will find qr code anywhere and if you select or click this select action link you can just verify that one and here is a little explanation as you can see and this brings you to the settings of this app. There are only two settings and a response mapping feature. So let's just enter some of this. The contents of your, Q your QR code are for example a ref URL. So let's just make something up really quick. Let's send somebody to google.com. It's just something really quick and a short line of text beneath the QR code I'm going to show you what that means as well short intro text intro text and of course you need A URL for the image of course here it says optional right here but it is not optional because you will need it to call the image so I just call it test field something I just use for everything that I'm testing so now a link will be created to show a QR code image so below you'll find the QR code just really quick get an image let's just do this one really quick did I have one here yep I did just make it a habit to always enter a content type image we don't know what it is so we use an url and we used test field just put that in here and click publish now of course this is a really simple version um, the template version is a lot bigger with some extra things that you can look at um, if you want to try it but these are the basics so now I will show you 
what it looks like when I'm opening my messenger. Just hold on while I'll get my screen. So here on screen you can see my phone right now with the message. There is the screen with the message that you have on the... Oh, hold on. I'm just moving this a little to the wrong side. Here it is. Create a QR code. It's the same as you see on screen right there. I'll say let's do it. And now it should create a QR code. And there you go. As you can see, this is the image. It says short intro text, which was exactly, oh, there I go again, moving everything around. Let's keep it like this. That's exactly what we put in here. You can of course just remove that. I'll show you what it looks like then. Save this one, click publish. Value not specified. Of course I should click backspace. So it's removed. That's a little tip right there. If you get that error, just click backspace on your keyboard and it will be completely emptied out. As you can see, now it will just save perfectly. Click preview again. Just go back to this image. Click let's go. And right now the subtitle text will not be there. Right there, as you can see. It's a clean image. If you scan this right now, you will see you'll go to Kogol because that is the URL that we entered there. So it's really, really easy. You can just put these actions everywhere you want. You can use your own custom information, your ref URL, or you can just include like a first name in there or a date or a coupon or whatever you want and just put it anywhere you want. It's a lot of fun. So enjoy it. Bye bye.